Award-winning filmmaker and novelist Nick Brooks has a new social thriller young adult novel drawing on his firsthand experience as an educator. Take a look. Well, it was one that was on my heart because I, I was an educator. I worked in DCPS for about six years and it's, you know, I repeatedly saw things that I didn't think were right. Um, I repeatedly saw choices that were being made that didn't serve students and so I wanted to bring that to the forefront. I wanted to talk about it, and uh, hopefully I think this will cause other teachers and other educators, not just in D.C., but around the country, to come forward and tell their stories as well. The world, the characters, everything that I developed in this story was really inspired by my experience as an educator. Uh, each one of the boys, J.B., Trey, Ramon, they're all inspired so in some way by uh, the boys that I work with in D.C., uh, and inspired by myself. So, you know, def <laughs> you know, without the experience of being an educator, uh, particularly in my city, in my community, uh, I don't think I would have been able to write this book. I think JB being the aspiring rapper um, was a lot of my story. You know, Ramon being the dreamer, the big dreamer and the entrepreneur is a lot of my story. And then you have Trey, who is uh, the life of the party, you know, but, but at home he's dealing with things, uh, family issues that um, cause him to, to, to use school as almost an escape, you know, um, because he doesn't want to be, be in the house. And so, all of these things are things that I, I've experienced, things that I know my students have experienced, and all of it kind of came pouring out on the page. Well, in addition to the, the, the thrilling elements of the mystery and, and the crime and the, you know, the twists and turns, um, there's the, this context that we're talking about, you know, the idea of asking the tough questions of our education system. I think that's the social element. I think it's something that's bubbling in the zeitgeist. Uh, we think about like Abbott Elementary is a great example of something that has just emerged in the last few years. It's something definitely that I think people are starting to, to look at. And so that's the social element and I think it's gonna just continue to, to bubble from here. I think people are gonna continue to look at the education system and Promise Boys is not where it's gonna stop. You know, I'm from DC and as a storyteller, I think it's always important to, to tell stories that are authentic to me, things that feel real. I think the, the more real that it is to me, the more real it will feel to my audience and, and, and readers. So that's really why I wanted to set it in my city because it's a, it's a city that I know. The kids are the kids that I know, the slang, the lingo, the way they dress, uh, the things that they eat, everything, you know, the buses that they take, the way they, they walk to school, like all of these things are little details that I can add to make the environment feel more and more real. And so that's why I wanted to set it in a place that I was familiar with. I like to kind of set my stories in worlds, as we call them. So, you know, so this one obviously is taking place in a school, and I like to set them in worlds that I'm familiar with. So music business, um, I'm thinking about a story right now that's set in and around the foster care system. So definitely, uh, I like to set my stories in, in these different places, and so I get to like peel back layers. I love, that's like my favorite phrase. I want to peel back the layers of these different institutions, and so um, you can expect something, something pretty cool next. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a TV series. Uh, we've actually landed at Netflix. Um, I have the very uh, unique opportunity of being able to adapt along with my partner, my business partner and co-writer. Um, so we're really excited about that. And uh, you know, Higher Ground and Temple Hill are producing it. So we have a really, really strong team and um, I can't wait to, to share more. The Promise Boys, for more information, you can check out thenickbrooks.com or follow him on Instagram at officialnickbrooks.